And, you know, I wrote a few remarks, and I'm going to actually read them because we go into a little detail. But I will tell you that Hillary Clinton — and, you know, I call her crooked Hillary because all you have to do is read any newspaper you want. But Hillary Clinton wants to abolish the Second Amendment. Just remember that. We're not talking about change it. She wants to abolish the Second Amendment. So we're not going to let that happen. I can tell you that right now. We're going to preserve it. We're going to cherish it. We're going to take care of it, okay? You know, they keep chipping away. They talk about the magazines. They talk about the bullets. Uh, we're going to — we're going to take care of it. You know, um, a couple of things before I give you some more detailed remarks. I — I feel uh, — really happy with what's going on. You know, the Fox poll came out three days ago, and in the Fox poll, I'm leading Hillary, 41 to 44. 44. And last night, Rasmussen, which is a highly respected poll, came out. Trump, 42. Crooked Hillary Clinton, 37. So we're doing well. Now, with all that, we have a long way to go. But if you get every one of your friends to go vote, because there's a big difference. You know, on a lot of the things, there's a difference. And some are subtle, some are big. And by the way, we're in Kentucky. We're going to put the miners back to work before I forget about that. We're going to put the miners. We just left. And, and I also won Kentucky, so I love Kentucky. I used to work in Cincinnati for two summers. I worked in Cincinnati doing a job with my father. And I loved — I loved Cincinnati, and I'd come over the line, and I'd be in Kentucky. You wouldn't be — you'd be surprised how much I know about Kentucky. But uh, it's — it's an amazing place. But I said when I won New York, because we won New York in a landslide, and then Pennsylvania and Maryland, and we won everything. We were winning everything. Uh, we won Connecticut, Delaware, Rhode Island. And then we went to West Virginia, and boy, did I win. Did we do well in West Virginia. Wow. But all landslides, we won in all of the states I mentioned and more. Every single county in every single state. That's called a victory. And we won by massive percentages in the 60s and some in the 70s. And then, of course, we went to Indiana. As you know, that was going to be — that was going to be the firewall for the other side. And it turned out to be a massive victory for us again. It didn't hurt that Bobby Knight came out and said, I want Trump to win. That didn't hurt. If, if you're in Indiana and Bobby Knight endorses you, that's — I guess that's about as good as it gets. So I just want to say that I've been watching what's going on, and I've been looking at airplanes getting blown up in the air and lots of bad things happening. It's just not the same. And we're going to bring it back, and we're going to bring it back to a real place where we don't have to be so frightened, where we don't have to be so afraid. And you know what's happening in the schools, and you know what's happening everywhere. We're going to bring it back, and you folks are going to be so happy, and you're going to be so proud of your country again. Just remember.